All right, it is uh, Saturday, September 12th. It's 8.34 p.m. and the temperature is 20 degrees Celsius. Abdulli, you were not first. <laughs> What's up, Alex? What's up, Abdulli? Bad boy? Greetings, VC. Oh, white water, white rock, BC. I'm just waiting for a few more people to join in, then I'll get up and start moving around. Whoa, I gotta put some more slack. Sorry about that. Greetings, Mark. Mark, I have to send you a message about that. Patreon requests. You should be able to look for that early next week. Greetings, Deborah. Thanks, Peter. I'll just wander around this traffic circle area for a second. Good evening, Julian. I would head over to Christy Pitts Park over there, but it's pitch black. Good evening, John, Uncle Sam. This is in front of Christie Station. So I'm at Bloor and Christie right now. High Park. No, we're pretty far from High Park. Looks like little Korea. That is correct, Denise. Greeting, Susie. Impossible to shoot less. That is very hard to do. Jesus or Jesus? Carla, hi. Tara, hi. Punks usually hang out in the dark. Well, they did have the Christie Pitts riots here a long, long time ago, right? That's what this park is perhaps most well known for. All right, we got 46 people in three minutes. Maybe it's time to start moving here. I'm gonna just walk east through Koreatown and then the annex, and then I'll let you guys call the shots maybe. Jenny Rotpoof, what's up? Punks unite. <laughs> I think there's a fair bit of people out tonight. I do hope I missed some of your messages and chats. I don't think I'm that fit, BC, or VC. I did go for a long walk earlier today. I went home, I made dinner, and I edited it, and started uploading, and then I came out to start this stream. Good evening, Jeanette. So what is your planned path tonight? Uh, we're gonna head east through Koreatown and the Annex, and then I don't know. I kind of like the idea of not having a fixed route on these live streams. That way I can just kind of wander around wherever. Yeah, the video should be tomorrow morning, Alex, if all goes well. I think you're a fit. And then I'll I'll get into that. This is champions off track betting. And hey look, Clinton's is open, but under new ownership and management. go to Jarvis. We might be staying on the uh, the west side of Young for the night. I don't know. 
Greetings, Susan and Joel. This is Clinton Street and it looks like this Japanese themed bar has an outdoor patio going. <laughs> Action Kid, welcome to the stream. Hey Johnny, do you watch any TV shows? Uh, I'm kind of in between right now. Greetings, Claudia. I'm having trouble reading my screen while I'm walking around tonight. I don't know if my eyes are starting to go or what, but... Imgana Korean Restaurant. There is an L there, but you don't pronounce it. Greetings, Red Robin. It's the old adult theater, which is now a uh, rock climbing gym. Base camp is open. Visit website for more info. Have you checked out Cobra Kai? No, Netflix keeps shoving that down my throat. And the more it does that, the less it makes me want to watch it. You do forget to do live beach walk. Remember I told you before? I did a live beach walk, Jill. That was the last one I did. Roland, greetings, greetings, Bobby. There's the PAT. That used to be my local supermarket, believe it or not. I see a lot of cyclists in the bike lanes without lights on their bike. That's never good. This guy's going through a red light with no helmet, no lights. Like the Millers. Are you originally from? I'm from the uh, Toronto area. Is this young? No, it's not Jane. This is Bluer. Yes, Denise, my uh, connection died at Coxwell. Both of my providers didn't work, so I was almost out of battery. It was pretty much the end anyway, so I just decided not to continue. Samurai, what's up? Nick, do you think Bloor? This part of Bloor is an excellent area. Maybe I'll do a, a Halloween night walk. That's a good idea. Deborah H. I almost said your last name there, Deborah. Whoops. <laughs> Damn it, do you think Kipling and Dundas? I think so, Nick. Do people watch Letter Kenny? I think they do. <laughs> Those Korean people just commented that I was live streaming. I made sure they got a look at the, uh, the chat. Have you gone by Palmerston yet? No, I haven't. Palmerston is coming up. BZ, sorry, if I slow down, that's because I'm trying to read the screen. It's harder to read at night. I live in Midtown. Have you been to the Adamson Barbecue? I have not. JJ Muggs, that's a suburban sounding place. Hey, it's for people that were talking about Kenny vs. Spenny on my last vlog, this is where they would always go for their magic potions or whatever. Dr. Goldfield was the doctor who worked in there and gave them some incredibly sketchy advice. You hope tomorrow it doesn't rain. I hope it does rain tomorrow because I'll be watching football inside all day and I haven't done a rain walk video in a long time so it'd be kind of nice if it did rain.
screwed when there are two create well some people consider Shepherd to Finch a Korea town, but to me this is pretty much the Korea town. Have you done a Parkdale? I've done several Parkdale walks, Terry. And I even did a live stream through Parkdale. Did we reach 500 live yet since you started? Uh, no, we've been over 400. But since it's a Saturday night, we might get a little closer to that. That's good, Alex. Kung Fu tea. What's your favorite Korean food? My favorite, I'll show you actually, just up here. We will go by the restaurant that serves my favorite Korean food. How's that sound? How many Asian languages do you speak? I speak barely Korean. <laughs> Don't be sorry, Terry. It's all good. But you know what, actually... No worries on that, Jill. All right. Deborah asked about Palmerston. Palmerston is coming up. ever been to the Philippines? Yes, I have, Brad. I went to Manila and Cebu and a few other places in between and Boracay before they drastically changed it. I don't know how else to say that. This restaurant on the corner used to be one of my favorite restaurants here, but it's changed names. It's now a rice hot dog restaurant. You can see on Palmerston, or Palmerston, which Deborah was asking about earlier, they have those really old style street lights. Maybe we can go take a look at those. Is Mama Korea any good? It is good. Is it, is it still shorts weather? I am wearing shorts right now. So it's short, shorts weather for me. What? That's, that, was a, that was next door. You were All right, you can't see them that well, but this is a particularly nice residential street. 178 viewers in 13 minutes already. Seems like Saturdays are the night to do these. And for those who are asking about my favorite Korean food, we're about to get there. This makes me crave food HEK. <laughs> Did you know Bude Chige was actually a Korean military food? That's why there's spam in it. They're looking for something they could make that was cheap out of all the leftovers that didn't get stale. And here is my favorite Korean food. This is probably my favorite food in the whole world, actually. The best combo we can do is actually... It is a cheese duck galbi. Let's see if that right there says Han Cook Cheese Duck Galbi. There it is. There's the duck galbi, but that one is not covered in cheese. At least it's not smothered in cheese. What about beaver tails? Beaver tails are a snack. They're good. That's like asking if you like ice cream. No one's gonna say no to that. Jay walking. And I didn't die. Maybe David. 
almost as good as a Newfie steak. Greetings in Uruguay. Korean banh mi? Is there such thing as Korean banh mi? Wouldn't that just be a sandwich? Ooh, thanks for hitting the like button, Claudia. Don't forget to check your bank balance and super chat whatever amount that is. Just kidding. Yep, that's the old Honest Ed's. It's now going to be... People keep saying they're condos, but they're not. It's actually a purpose-built rental complex going in. And they tore down one of my favorite bars in the area to make it, which was the Victory Cafe. It was part of Mervish, Mervish Village. Thanks, Patricia. Thanks, Bobby. I have, Stephen. I've seen every Kenny vs. Spenny. And this restaurant has the most ridiculous menu. It's huge. Every soup. Greetings, Josh. Is Insomnia still there? We're about to walk by Insomnia, Deborah. <laughs> Pather Station. Well, maybe now that people are working from home, Pather Station will be relieved a bit. Do you like Rush? I don't not like Rush. Susan, how do you miss a McDonald's? <laughs> And in case you're wondering what those people are lined up for. They're buying weed. He did, Roland. The famous annual turkey giveaway. But let's be real, that was really just a giant junk store. Okay, the sign says no left turn and that car was turning left. Those were some justified honks, as annoying as they sounded. Only one, oh, that's why, that makes sense. Do you like the crash test dummies? I don't not like them. Ah, the green beanery is gone. Thank goodness. The owner of that place was a climate change denier. They also had a no Wi-Fi policy, which is kind of stupid since everyone has LTE in their pocket these days anyways. And Deborah H. <laughs> Sounds like a New York City driver. There's your insomnia, Deborah. There's a place I can't go by without talking about. Oh, that is some really good Korean fried chicken. The Punjab here. You ready? You know what? That Popeyes used to be a Korean restaurant I really liked. It is 8.53. What's for dinner tonight? I had a, uh, a frozen pizza. <laughs> they were like $2.99 at Metro a few weeks ago, so I bought a stack of them. Uh-oh, guys. Do you see this conundrum? And what is across the street? Jeff Nehajovic, thank you for the super chat, Jeff. And I have been out to Nova Scotia, but unfortunately only as 
a little pipsqueak kid. I haven't been there in a while. I'd love to go back. And it looks like Popper's Pub is pretty packed. Brad Robin, I think you've asked that question before. Damn the Popeyes and NW. Yeah, and I hope my uh, YouTube channel has something to do with that. I'm kind of an ambassador for those brands. They'll uh, reward me someday. You ever been to PEI as a kid? Yeah, we're up to 254 people. Normally, we don't even hit that much. I think the Saturday night has something to do with it. Maybe there's a lot of Raptors fans who want to keep their mind off of whatever it was that happened last night. You do have A&Ws in the city, but I assure you they're not that good. Hey, there's a supercar. And look at that. Sadika Cannabis. Yeah, sadly, Lee's Palace. Hey, another Ferrari, wow. vegan soft serve. Greetings, Chris. Whoever keeps telling me to quote unquote meet some women's, that's not appreciated. Just an FYI, we do have, I think, three moderators in the chat tonight. And there's the Crafty Coyote, which is owned by the same people I believe who own the Victory Cafe, the new Victory Cafe, which is completely not like the old Victory Cafe, unfortunately. They took my favorite bar and turned it into a pizza restaurant. Kind of a downer. Thank you, Eduardo. How is the virus in Toronto? I think it's just as shitty here as everywhere else. Our numbers are increasing, but that's probably to do with school. Future Bakery is still around here. What do you mean it used to be around here? There's L Furniture. I'll just move quickly so I don't get dinged with that music. Or the person saying Future Bakery used to be around here. There is Future Bakery. And there used to be one down in Queen West. And then that area got gentrified and they got swept out. There was a place down there called Gypsy Co-op as well, which was a similar kind of place. Go and just go. I can't, Raphael. There are no, uh... Oh, that guy had a gas motor on his bicycle. I don't think that's legal. This is the Annex. We started in Koreatown. Greetings, Estelle. Looks like Mai Mai is not open. There's the used bookstore. 
I don't think they're open. Gasoline motors on bicycles are illegal. I thought they were a Mitch. There was a thread on Reddit about them the other day, and that seemed to be the consensus. I'll double check that. Good morning, Richard. And now the area gets a bit quieter. Haven plant-based energy. <laughs> Shout out to Monica. Sure, what's up, Monica? We need to get the mods after Chris F. Action kid, wake up. Do your uh, do your modding. Yeah, the e-scooters are everywhere, but they shouldn't be in the bike lanes. E-scooters are supposed to be on the roads, but e-bikes with the they're called pedalics or pedalics, those are allowed in the bike lanes. What is Metro? It's a giant 24 hour massage shop. Bev, you're correct, it was a Dominion. I used to shop there when it was a Dominion. Okay, Raf Raphael, you are gone. Sorry, buddy. Time out for Raphael. <laughs> Jeanette, thank you. Super chat for from Jeanette. Looks like someone's gonna have a late night snack tonight after my $2.99 frozen pizza. Greetings, Carl. Thanks, Carl. So for those that know the city, things are going to be a bit quiet for the next little while. So I'm going to give you guys a choice here. <laughs> Do you guys want me to head east down Bloor Street, past Yorkville, or are we going to go south down Spadina through Chinatown? There's going to be about eight or nine minutes of 
relatively quiet walking if I go south to Chinatown, and probably five minutes or so of relatively quiet walking if I head east. So do we want through Yorkville or to Chinatown? Let's see your votes. If you pick nothing, I will just stand here and not move. Erica's voting for Bluer. Erica Jang, Bluer. East and go to the Maddie. Yorkville, East on Bluer. Everyone's voting for East. Oh, we got some South, Chinatown, China, oh, Chinatown making a comeback. South, South, Bluer, Bluer, South, East. All right. <laughs> Yorkville, Yorkville, Chinatown. I think, uh, I think Chinatown has won with the late comeback. Oh, but Jeanette says Yorkville. Her vote's worth like 10. Action Kids says Chinatown. Okay, Action Kids the tiebreaker. The problem with that is, is like I said, there's gonna be about eight minutes of relatively quiet walking, but that's okay. Split the difference and walk through U of T. Split the difference and don't go anywhere interesting. Erica, we'll do Yorkville. I'll get, I promise you I'll do Yorkville the next time I do one of these later night walks. Action Kid says Bluer. Well, you already said Chinatown. Greetings in Chicago. Maybe what I should have done was gone east to like Bay Street and then south, and then it would have been kind of interesting the whole way. Should walk west on college. Speaking of Castelloma Night Walk, that would be cool. I could always turn around and go back. But speaking of college, tomorrow's video, I walked from where college starts at Dundas and I went east all the way across to College and Young. It's about an hour and 10 minutes and it's taking me forever to upload. Albert, I think we're at one Popeyes and one a and W. Bay Street, yeah, too late. We're committed to, uh, we're committed to Chinatown, guys. Let me check, I don't have my battery pack on me because I'm an idiot, but we're at 72%. That should be good. I did not know they were going to rename Dundas. If they call it anything but Dundas, I will be disappointed. I'm gonna maybe power walk this part just because there's not a whole lot to see. We're at 341 viewers, but there's a good chance it'll be less than that. But let's go hit Chinatown. You know what? I could probably hop a streetcar even. Hmm, should I jump on the streetcar if I see one? Go west on college, please. Get so... <laughs> yeah, that'll take us... Uh, you... No, college is alright if you go west. If you go east, it's dead. If you go west, you'll find... a lot of places. Grab a pizza at Papacio. take the streetcar. People are telling me, but can I get on the streetcar with this thing in my hand? Someone might decide that's a, that's a good moment to take out the old kneecaps. Maybe when I get to uh, 
harbored, I'll look back and see if we can see a streetcar. Yep, look, we've lost viewers like crazy because of this quiet walk. We're now in the 319. People are tuning in and being like, what? He's walking through nowhere. Someone told me to go to Papacio. But what about... They don't, Kumi. But what about Cora? Their, uh, their rival pizza shop. I think most people in this area pick one and they have a strong allegiance to it. There's Papacio. No, the streetcar's here. Womp, 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 we are not getting on the streetcar. I even had my mask in my hand, ready to go. What's Kensington like tonight? We'll be right by Kensington. <laughs> right. Mary, it's 9.10. Don't worry, we're almost somewhere interesting again. Yeah, it's really not worth waiting for another streetcar because by the time it comes, we'll be at Chinatown. People like to see the CN Tower. I think I'll pass on that, Mark. How often do they pass? I No, it's normally like every five to ten minutes. During peak hours, it's even more than that. Are you past the... I'm almost at the roundabout, Josh. I'm firmly in the middle of nowhere. Good night, Lenny. I don't know what that is, Stephen. I just got a notification that somebody else is live walking now. Brad, you missed Koreatown and the Annex. And then the exciting vote. It's all good, we're almost back to civilization. Can you shoot a video using a, using a streetcar? Or do I put it on my shoulder and put the camera on top? You are allowed to record on the TTC as long as it's not a commercial production. And since my videos are monetized, I'm not gonna question if this counts as that or not. I'm just going to assume it doesn't. Uh, 
Okay, so we're at the Daniels building. This is the UFT's architecture school, I believe. I like to say I believe a lot because that exonerates me for being wrong. Greetings in Argentina. Your lens is a little blurry. Can anyone else confirm? Does this look more blurry than usual or is it the same? Because we are streaming 720p, so it's not. Adam, it's quite warm actually. I'm wearing a sweater and I don't think I had to. Thanks guys. I love the delay. I ask a question then 40 seconds later <laughs> the response is rolling. Thanks Vera. Greetings, Yakka. I don't know how to say that. Now pixelated. If it's pixelated, that's probably just the connection turning to shit. It'll get better if I keep walking. I need to jaywalk, so I'm just waiting for the all clear. Jay Zinger. Thank you, Jay Zinger. Super chat from Niagara Falls. I hope to be in Niagara Falls soon. Monetize Johnny. I, I have monetized, Michelle. Go to Jane and Finch or Rexdale. Uh, maybe not for a night walk. And if I do, it'd be better if I stream it. That is not safe. <laughs> Denise, I was looking over my shoulder the whole way, don't worry. Greetings, Pedro. San Antonio. All right. We are back in civilization. I just have to navigate a homeless shelter, which I don't even know if it's operating anymore. Is the Scott Mission still open? Because normally there would be 100,000 people outside right now. I know the Silver Dollar Room is gone. Oh yeah, it's open. There's people in there. Oh, Adam, sorry to hear that. Thanks for tuning in, but I've heard the air quality is not good right now in that state. The dirty Waverly. Maybe we'll live stream getting a room at the Waverly. We're about to go by the Alma Combo. Hmm, do I go on the east side or the west side? Nancy, was that confirmed they're closing Sneaky D's? I know they're losing that location. But I don't think they said they're closing it. So which side of Chinatown, guys? The right side or the left side? <laughs> go to cum jugs. <laughs> we used to make fun of that place. All the votes are for the west. I actually kind of like the east, but we'll stay on this side. All right. 
Popeyes 2 and W1. There's the official count. And there's the Alma Combo. I think it's just operating as a bar right now. Susan I have, but they were school trips, so I don't know if that really counts. If it's empty, you can fill it with people like that. Hey guys, that's the guy from the Dragon's Den. That's the owner of the Alma Combo. We just saw a sort of celebrity who's super duper rich. That's crazy. He looked too busy, I didn't feel like stopping him. And I'm guessing this is his car, because he came from this way. One man. I'm sure that's his car. <laughs> Paparazzi. Yeah, his name's Michael something. He's gotta be real famous. We don't even know his name. There we go. A sort of celebrity. I don't know if that counts. I saw, or I saw Stephen A. Smith in a video last year walking around Toronto, but he's not a celebrity, he's just an idiot. Paparazzi. And I would be willing to bet that Porsche was his car. Greetings, Ralph. Kevin Hart, I don't think he was. Canton Chili, I talked about this in my video through Chinatown. It is excellent. Michael, what curl? Is TIFF canceled? I don't know. They said it wasn't going to be, but we can't have Americans here, so I don't know. This is the worst Chinese food in the city of Toronto. What's up, Dina? Maybe it was one of Ken's videos. Did you do any videos during the wrap? I did, Jane. I worked at First Canadian Place at the time, so I just popped down with my camera, took the day off work and filmed the parade. TIFF is an online event this year, that's lame. But what else can they do? Well, every Chinatown needs a Krispy Kreme, right? K-Flip, that's awesome. I'm a huge Roll Sand fan. I usually have their sweet and sour pork and pineapple, their Shanghai noodles, and their beef and broccoli. Are you walking to Kensington? I guess we could go west on Dundas and then come up Kensington. Let's see if the battery budget affords a Kensington trip. Yep, it does. Do you like the band Luna? I don't know who that is. Uh, Jay Zinger, I don't know. Whenever I decide to go visit family, I'll be there.
walk through Atkinson housing. <laughs> Thanks, Brad. Diane, no it is not. It's definitely not a normal night. Sure, maybe I'll do a Niagara Falls live stream. Yeah, this place is easily a lot more lively than this on a Saturday night, that's for sure. Especially since it's not even late, it's only 9.20. But maybe I'll head up Augusta Avenue in a second. People say that. They say that Tiff is one of the best. Oh, I missed it. There's Roll Sand. The green building, Susan, used to be haunted. <laughs> How do they get the uh, ghosts out? Come jugs coming up. <laughs> There's a Krispy Kreme at Harvard Street too. This is a must-try place in Chinatown. Maybe it was never really haunted. makes sense. I think I still have an email. Or an Instagram message to reply to you. Time lapse. Sorry about that. I've got about a hundred that I haven't even looked at. Which is weird because I don't even have that many followers. People like to message me but... Is Nuit Blanche cancelled? I don't know. Maybe I should know these things. I think the Halloween event at Casa Loma is not cancelled. I saw on their website that they're planning it still. What time of year would be good to visit Toronto? I would say anywhere spring to fall. Winter's not particularly good. It's not bad, it's just the same but colder. It's a KTV. Mm -hmm. 
this used to be a 488. How cold does it get in winter? I don't know, it can drop below zero. It doesn't get that cold, it doesn't get stupid cold like minus 20. How do you not get mugged? Because if anyone tries to mug me, I punch him in the face. That or Toronto's just incredibly safe and the people that say it's not safe only focus on negative headlines they see. That's probably the real answer. <laughs> Greetings, Hendrix. I love when people <laughs> see me film it and they start whispering to each other. It does, tripod. Yeah, I don't think that guy should be looking at his phone riding his bike down the sidewalk. It's just a, just a hunch there. And now we are in Kensington. Thank you, Susan. Please tell that to everybody and anybody you see doing that. Trisha, thank you. Do you live downtown? No, I don't. Johnny Strides. Uh, I'm live streaming right now. Do you mind? Johnny Strides. <laughs> Thank you, Railroad. Johnny will soon be one of the most powerful people in Canada. I hope I'm not powerful. There's the handlebar. Someone's having fun back there. Thank you. Here's Bellevue Square Park where there's no doubt zero alcohol being driven, I bet. Oh, there's a party bus going by. I don't know how. Circus bus. <laughs> Doesn't seem particularly appropriate given, given the situation. <laughs> yeah, I was not expecting to see that. <laughs> I should join them. 
I don't get it, because they can't drink on that thing, so what the heck is winding them up so much? Maybe it's the hot boxed Corona bus. How far are you from Toronto Western Hospital? That's about a five minute walk west of here, directly west of here. <laughs> Brad, somebody had to say it. I won't repeat it, but that was the first thing that came to my mind. Are they throwing beads? I don't know. The COVID Express. Hot box coming up. I don't know, should I just keep walking to the north? I thought about turning back, but what the heck. How's it going, mate? Good, you? It's weird how normal Kensington is and yet how dead Chinatown was. It's the same part of town, I guess. It's just a completely different crowd at this hour. Susan, it is. And he came to a Mexican restaurant here that's no longer. And he raved about it. And then as soon as they filmed that episode, it closed. All right, I wonder where the party bus is off to. Vlogging? Huh, live streaming. Live streaming? Yeah, do you mind being on it? Uh, yeah, we'll, 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 we'll <laughs> right here. <laughs> uh, YouTube. Huh? What's your channel? It's called Johnny Strides. Johnny Strides? Yeah. Alright, we'll check it out. Cheers. Alright, some people. Uh, people are talkative tonight, I guess. You're welcome, Brad. I guess people are just breaking the law. Maybe, yeah. So before, so I, got to, before I got to Gus. Oh. Channel business cards. Thought the whole point of the digital revolution was to get away from that crap. Go to TTC, please. <laughs> Go there and do what?
Do you ever come to Thailand? I do. I have videos from Thailand on the channel. All right, that's uh, pretty much the end of Kensington. Did I miss the plant car? Oh well. Too many people in one area? Yeah, that's a very busy, busy ass place. It certainly seems like that demographic of people would rather just pretend there is no pandemic, I guess. And I'm back to beautiful College Street. We're hunting for the party bus. One of you is DMing me on Instagram right now. Obviously, I'm not going to check it. Go to Timeless. Am I friends with any uni professors? I don't think so. Diane, I don't. I approximate it sometimes. And I have a step counter on my wrist, but that's it. It did, Carl. I actually talked about that in the video I filmed earlier today. <laughs> they invited me in the bus. I think they'd make me turn off the camera. Phone yet ton, can you please buy a ticket? Well, I don't need a ticket to get on the TTC. But I don't think I'll be doing that on this stream. Kung Fu Tea. Walk all the way to Allen Gardens. I think I'm going to go south at this point. I just walked this part of College Street today, earlier. Favorite place for pho? There's a place on Ossington called the Painted Turtle that's quite excellent. Bill Sawyer, this is just a smartphone. Although in my other videos, I do use an Osmo. All right, I gotta power walk this. I do, Benson. And the tooth shattering gum. Yes, I just walked by a Popeyes. But we are on the other side of the street now. Horseshoe Tavern is right there. I, I don't know about right, right there, but the horseshoe is to the south of here. What time is it? Uh, I'm at 51%. So I think we got some life left. Thanks, Hiro.
Is your last name really? Yep, that's my exact name, Bill Sawyer. Cruise and Tangos. <laughs> that's in, uh, is that on church? I have heard of Church's Chicken. I've kind of started power walking a bit just because I already came down Chinatown, but we're on the other side of the street. So at least visually it's completely different. Grossman's Tavern. Thank you, Dina. I think my voice sounds quite ridiculous, but I think everyone thinks to have their own voice, right? All right, I think this stream might have broke my record for most people watching. That's pretty cool. Dina, is that for real? If so, congratulations. <laughs> Thanks, Tara. Where's Eaton's? Eaton's what? The supermarket? Are you still distancing? I follow the rules of whatever place I go to. If you have to wear a mask, I wear a mask. If you have to space out, I space out. Am I wearing a mask? Wow, my hair looks really effed up. Mozzie, thank you for the super sticker. Mosey or Mozzie? What's your most cash from Super Chats? We've been, there was one night where everyone went crazy and I had like a $50 one and a $75 one and then a bunch of $20 ones. I don't know the amount. And then I did one midnight stream where I went down Young Street. It was probably my most dangerous stream and I didn't get a single one. So I don't know how that works. I'm not complaining. It is what it is, right? Mosey, got it. No, that was a typo. Do you enjoy bubble tea? Not particularly. Thanks, Soab Doi. I don't know if I said that right. I feel like a supply teacher reading names. Thanks, Frank. Oh, I thought that's, that said a KFC jeweler for a second there. We've, we've played that game many times. Over 30, under 40. Closer to 40. How's that? Much closer. The CN Tower is on the other side of the street. Where I can see it. It's not on the other side. I can see it from the other side. But we've already been on that side. I haven't, Benson.
And Frank, we were up to 460 something earlier. There's more Chinatown this way. I didn't film that car making a stupidly dangerous turn right in front of me. Whoa, this e-scooter should not be on the sidewalk. Brad, I have. You look 34. Thanks. Hey, change. Sorry. Are they maracas? I don't know. Cars looking for a gas station. Yeah, there's not a lot of gas stations downtown. Thanks, Tillian, Titlian, sorry I can't read your name right now. You could pass for late 20s. Well, I did the Guess Your Age game at the CNE last year, and the guy guessed 27. Where are you? Yep, we're on Spadina, heading south. I don't know, AAPP, we've been doing it for a while. I haven't been killed yet. Do you eat sushi? Yes, I do. I went through my whole life avoiding sushi because I don't like fish. And then one day I had a date and she took me to sushi and I thought, if I'm ever going to try, now's the time. And I actually loved it. So since that moment, I eat sushi. Rhino with a twist. Good evening. This area looks a bit busted, but we're heading down to Queen West. Or King West, whichever people want to see. Do you guys want to see King West or Queen West? Phone me at ton. I'm not going on the TTC on this ride or this walk. I've done it in so many videos before though. If you just search the channel, you'll find at least a dozen transit videos. I already did, but I've already done Queen West in a live stream too. So. Okay, why don't we do both? Here's the question. Do I go left on Queen or right on Queen? We got votes. Okay, I'll do some of Queen and then I'll head down to King. But I should do King around Portland where it's all kind of interesting. Okay, guys, am I going west on Queen? Which is right or east on Queen, which is left? That's the vote. We're going to turn at Queen. stop at the horseshoe to see what's going well if you want me to go to the horseshoe you got to vote east oh we got votes for right i don't like that that's taking me away from transit west left right right east left west west east okay i think left or east is winning <laughs> 
someone said east right. Oh. Sorry guys, I can't. I literally did not see. This is a bad idea because the chat goes by so fast. Left, left, horseshoe, west, west, left. Okay, we're just gonna go left. Sorry if I went the wrong way, I'll go and catch the other way. Or maybe I could just do a circle. I could go here, I could go left and then down and then over King and then up Bathurst and then I'll come down the other side. All right, I think I found a way that'll accommodate everyone. And then I should probably be at the end of the stream. So we're gonna go check out the horseshoe. Someone said good night, good night. Go where there's cool things, that's the thing. There's cool things in all of the suggestions I had there. I don't think it'll be fun as the party bus. Brad Burns, I watch uh, Lewis Rossman a lot actually. Not so much as board repair videos, but they're still interesting. Don't ask us, pick up your mind. All right, we're about to go by the Rivoli. Hey, where's Rexdale? Rexdale is on the far, far west of the city. Kind of northwest of Tobico. There's the Rivoli. Maybe they should take that sign down. I don't think that's. The right night. NW takeover. It is. This is an awesome sidewalk. I've made a deliberate point to avoid Young Street in this walk just because I've live streamed from Young and I'm sure I will do it again very soon. So this is kind of like a cleanse of Young Street. And maybe in the next one, I'll have to avoid Queen and King. I was thinking of doing one from the little Jamaica area out on Eglinton West. That's kind of a cool area. Alex, that's the idea behind uh, this one tonight. No young. Do you bike ride tomorrow? I'm going to try, Zach McNally. I'm going to try to get to Tommy Thompson in the morning if I wake up. Big up, Jimmy. <laughs> Someone was telling me Little Jamaica was dangerous and I don't think it is at all. So I think a live stream from there at night would kind of prove that it's not. Still waiting for Tommy Thompson, yep. It's the walk I keep promising and fail to deliver. They just had a shooting here. If there's a shooting, we better go investigate.
Greetings, H A H R R. Jmart, they are. Clubs are not, bars are. We're gonna go by a, a few noisy ones just up ahead. And maybe I won't go down King. We'll save King for another stream. I might just keep going straight to uh, Queen Station here. Susan, you're correct. No, I think Club Monaco was actually a bit more west of there. That used to be an urban planet, I think, that shoppers. Any good used bookstores on Queen? Not that I know of. It, it's a live stream. You're in it now. People are talkative tonight. Thanks, John. My schedule is purely random. And I don't know why I'm standing at this intersection when I have a walk sign. Indeed, Bev. It's the old Moses Zneimer headquarters right there. No, not on here. We're watching you right now. Johnny Hey, what's up? Do you mind being in the video? Yeah, what's up? Hello, you too. How's it going? <laughs> hey everyone, I'm gonna I'm gonna meet this. That's crazy. We, yeah. we live right there, and we're like, we should just go ahead and meet him. Yeah. So you came out to say hi? We did. Yeah, yeah we we watch you all the time. Uh, Club Soda, if you'd like. I'm okay. Actually, do okay. you want to walk for a bit together? Yeah, or? let's do it. Yeah. All right. How's everyone doing tonight? Hey guys, maybe I'll flip that around. Hey guys. We've got some friends. Hope everyone's <laughs> enjoying their Saturday night. So I'm trying to read this and respond while not like kill myself. So you actually come down to this area a lot. Like, what brings you down here? To be honest, it's more interesting. Like, like, I live at Young and Eglinton, yeah. So this is kind of. Yeah, there's always a lot to do on a Saturday. And oh, we got the party bus again. Oh no, this is a different one. Yeah. That's the second time we've been by them today. I saw them at a Kensington Market like half an hour ago. Do they just rent out those buses or what? I don't know, but yeah. it seems slightly irresponsible. Uh, slightly. It's slightly underage. <laughs> <laughs> but if you're not drinking, how are you so amped up? Uh, just, just Youth? They painted over the Kauai mural. Oh yeah, that's right. Do you remember the Kauai mural yep. that was up there? Everyone's calling it the COVID bus, party bus people. So you guys live down here? Yeah, we just live at uh, that building there. All right. Uh, on well, Richmond and Simcoe. Maybe I won't point at it exactly. <laughs> uh, but you've walked by it before. Probably a dozen uh, times. Yeah, so how long have you been doing this? A couple months now, I guess? I've or? live streamed for like a month and a half. Yeah. But I've been doing the channel for almost two years now. And you just use the, the gimbal there in your phone? For live streaming, I have a totally different setup for my other videos. Uh -huh. but I thought it'd be like GoPro, I didn't realize you were like GoPro. For the live streaming, you have to. If you use the GoPro, you can't see the chat. And if I can't see the chat, what's the point? I'm surprised how many messages you 
yet. <laughs> there's 430 following right now. I'm glad to know that there's other people that like to just put on videos like yours for the ambiance and then just kind of hang out. I feel like it's really calming and it compliments your night. Yeah, I, I used to only do quiet videos, but other, pe other people were doing that. So I kind of went the other direction and just started yapping and my viewership went up. So I was like, okay, I guess that works. You know what I really liked was your uh, biking video. Yeah, that one was pretty cool. I think, uh, I forget where, where you were going, but there was one that I saw and it's just like the way that you had mounted the gimbal to the bike, gave it a really nice effect. I put it on my chest actually. Oh, do you? Are you ever worried that the phone's gonna fall or something like that? No. no. Someone says hello to the sweet couple. I normally walk faster than this, it's all good. Johnny, have you tried the e-bikes? Not yet. Sorry guys if I've not responded to you. Too many freaking chats come through anyways. Greetings from the Philippines. Parasocial. I've had so many people talk to me tonight, so I'm not surprised that. I was thinking maybe I would go south and then hit along King Street through all the, the nightlife fun. Yeah. But I'm probably not going to do that. I might just keep on heading to a Queen Station at Young. Awesome. Okay, shall we? Let's go. It's nice to meet you guys. Take care. Come say hi next time if you want. <laughs> Cheers. There's a delay. I'm sure they're saying bye right now, but. <laughs> Ask them how many kids they want. Uh... Yeah, guys, I. Good night, Club Soda. <laughs> yeah. Hey, club soda is good. I think I don't think it was club soda. I think it was just sparkling water. Go to Moss Park. <laughs> I think I'm just gonna keep on heading east here, and then when I get to Young Street, we're gonna call it. Or maybe at the uh, maybe at City Hall. Good night in the Bahamas. How do you feel when people recognize you? I don't know, that's kind of cool. Walk up Sherburn, not tonight, Brad. Are there areas you haven't, yep, John, there's a lot. Two more hours. Sorry, Brad, I actually didn't bring my battery pack tonight. So, we're only at 36% battery, and I think at around 15%, it wants to shut off. Someone's in Playa del Carmen. Show the Candle Life building. All right, maybe when I get to the other side of the street, I will take a look over at Z Canada Life building. Kevin, I want to. I just find the suburbs kind of boring, to be honest with you. They're a bit better suited for biking videos. Auditor? Show the Google office on Richmond. Mostly Toronto. What other camera? I use a Osmo Pocket, Dino. And I have a different external microphone set up for that one. <laughs> Need to get a couple of brewskis. All right. Maybe <laughs> what's up in the heart of the city? Internet connection is unstable.
you ever seen First Amendment auditors? I don't even know what you're talking about. All right, guys. So I have a new, I have a new plan. We're gonna go north up Bay, and then I'm gonna. And I keep getting bad internet connection warnings. You were at the Tickled Toad for lunch. Do you sell merch? I don't, Benson. Do you want me to sell some low quality Teespring shirts? Like every other YouTuber? Yeah, sorry guys, there was a connection warning back there. Good night, Deborah. Thank you, Tan. Mugs, you want me to have? <laughs> Katie, you made it down to Toronto. Awesome. Press to play. I think I would feel the same as you if I went from the city to up there. Could be a weed strain. Man, I walked a lot tonight. My feet are starting to feel it, so tomorrow's gonna be a bike raid or a bike ride. Avoid Dundas and Sherburn at all costs. I've recorded through there, Rob. At night, it was fine. Generally, those people don't. Where is the Toronto sign? I think it's, it's being fixed up. I don't think the Toronto sign is there. I think it's, it's gone. Let's go take a look. Let's investigate. That's great, Katie. Glad you finally made it. <laughs> Is Lake Ontario frozen? Nope. Oh, we're going to miss Drum Guy. I'm not going that way. Yeah, you're exactly right. I have no idea what city I'm in right now. Without a giant sign to spell it out. I could go down to the CN Tower and remind myself what country we're in because there's a nice Canada sign there. <laughs> Are people really super chatting a politician? Do you like the urbanist? I don't know Benson. I will check that channel out later. Simon, what is your data plan? My data plan is 50 gigabytes. Oh, that's neat, Bev. Is it the same as the one at the CN Tower? I'm on a no Young Street mission tonight, and since we're ending up at Young Street, I'm gonna take Dundas over. Thank you, Penny. The Urbanist did a few walks with the Action Kid. Oh, I missed those. 50 gigabytes, uh, the plan, I have two plans. I have a six gigabyte with Freedom, but that's an old grandfathered plan. I pay 30 a month for that. I'm never giving that up. And that's my normal phone number. And then 
I use for TELUS, I get the 50 gigabyte plan and that's 125 a month. And there's no special deal or anything, I just walked into the store and got it. And that's now the phone number I use for my online activities. And that account isn't even in my, my actual real name somehow. I got away with setting that up. So I've got a, a different persona. So hopefully there'll be no identity theft. Do you know where Burma is? I do know where Burma is. Shouldn't everyone be able to point to that at least somewhat on the map? Yeah, don't worry, uh, Jennifer, I won't be going on party bus. ass YouTuber. Good night. You're welcome, Simon. <laughs> How many steps do you usually walk? I don't know, I do 20 to 30,000 a day. Most days. Would you end it at the bus station? No, we're gonna turn right on Dundas. I'm gonna end it at Dundas Square. We're gonna have a... a little moment in the square together and then I'll pretend something bad is happening. I'll scream and then I'll end the stream and you guys won't know what happened. Thanks, Brad Burns. All right, we've made it to Little Tokyo, although I won't be going that way. That's another area I think I record too much. Really? What kicks are you, you rocking? All right, Dina, I'll show you the shoes and you can try to guess the model in a second. Someone asked me what kicks I'm rocking. There you go. You're welcome. Trisha Shelby. I'm actually out of beers, but I opened up <laughs> Air Johnny's. I opened up a bottle of scotch last night. So I quite fancy having some when I get home. <laughs> Johnny going to the club tonight. For those saying New Balance 574, no, they are not. I have 574s at home, but they are not 574s. They're actually more of an obscure model. They're kind of a cross between the 574 and the 420. Tell someone there on YouTube and start running. CRH1. I have toured Little Tokyo many times, but I always go back to the same places. Just different times of day, different seasons, different weather, different directions. Can you walk closer to the road? I can't really, because there's these giant planter areas.
Do you like Jordans? Maybe we could all live stream each other. Yeah, maybe I should have been on the other side of Dundas. It's all good. My right foot is starting to break down on me. So we are heading to the square. I'm gonna sit down. I got a cliff bar in my bag. We're gonna eat that. No, I won't mukbang stream that part as much as you guys want to see that. John B. Young is under a lot of construction. The Air Jordan store is closing at Young and Dundas. I don't think that was a supposed to be a permanent store, was it? It always had it always had more of a pop-up vibe. I'm here to tell you tonight that God made you his image and For what flavor of Cliff Bar? What flavor of Cliff Bar? Dina asking all the questions that count. When you're living in sin, I think we've got a No, I'm not watching the preacher. I'm pulling out. To the devil to work in your life. There we and, go. And when the devil's working in your life, he's stealing your peace and joy. And he's ultimately taking your soul with him to hell. Because his time is running out, the time is late, and the hour is far spent. And judgment is coming upon the land. We are living in the end days. And it's not hard to see this. Just look around. Look at the state. Uh, thanks, Bev. Coronavirus, where we gotta be on, on, on being cautious all the time of six feet rules, and we can't go into places without masks, and everybody's afraid to, to hug each other anymore. <laughs> the chocolate. It is the best flavor of. So that Jordan is going to become a giant footlocker. 360. Let's go into the middle of the, uh, the square and we'll do your 360 spin. The old Hard Rock Cafe is under some kind of exterior renovation. Rob Young, thank you for the super chat. You got that one up at the buzzer. Thank you, Rob Young. That'll pay for most of the subway home. Much appreciated. <laughs> Chetna. Finally, the moderator speaks up. Cop should arrest that. He's actually quiet tonight. Benson, when he's really loud, it is really obnoxious. I don't care who you are or what your message is. Too loud is too loud. So this is the lost in translation moment in the night. Air Transat, for some reason, <laughs> is advertising all the flights they can't offer. Perhaps <laughs> it's seven. Man, I look pretty tired right now. It's been a long day of streaming. All right, guys. Thanks for all the super chats. Most recently from Rob Young. I'm going to shut this down in 30 seconds. If you haven't liked and subscribed, don't forget to. You're welcome, Jeanette. And, uh, yeah, thanks a lot, guys. I'll catch you later on the next one. Cheers.